Benign is a technical slot canyon about 20 minutes south of Hanksville, Utah. It requires a number of rappels, some chancy down climbs. It is really a worthy challenge if you're up to the task. Uh, we start from the top along a dirt road, which is not too bad. And from here, you have your initial rappel, which is actually really short. If I remember correctly, it's like 20 or 30 feet or something, but definitely check the guidebook on that. From here, then it's a, pretty, a collection of very straightforward slabs and down climbs um, until you get to the meat of the canyon, which also super interesting, has some really cool views. Um, once you get down to the lower part of the canyon, you have a few places where some teamwork is required to get down. And then the main obstacle is about a 40-foot down climb right into the valley floor. Once you get to the valley floor, all the fun is over. And then you have this super, super nasty um, bushwhack through some reeds to get up to the slab to start the climb out. <coughs> the climb out is actually really beautiful. And you can see the canyon from which you came. And when you get to the top, it's clear sailing back to the car. All in all, it is certainly a technical slot canyon, but not the most technical one in the Hangsville area. Definitely worthwhile if you have the time and expertise. That's very wavy. Ooh, there we go. That's it. A little, another couple inches down. Okay. Get your knee lock. Good. That's a good knee lock. What we've got here. What do we got here? We got some beauty at the bottom of the first rappel. Just kind of chilling out in the shade Lovely. as people are coming down. Grab a hole in your backpack. Here's a man. Oh, this is really grippy. Yeah. Not nearly as scary as it looked on top. Yeah. You could have walked it. And the sand is lava game. <laughs> so much fun. Whoa, what is, what is that over there? <laughs> <laughs> the ultimate playground, right? I mean, look at all these features and the colors and the textures. I mean, my goodness. And the water's the lava. I think I'm gonna take the easy route. It doesn't really seem like a jump I want to make very badly. No jump. Whoa. That was extra credit. That The flat easy part before we get into the next slot. This train is just gorgeous. I love all these steroid lines. It's very cool. All right, you might have to do that. Pull yourself tight. <laughs> that is a little wide. Look at that core strength. Yeah! And it's ending. Slide, yay! So much fun. You really get shelf down there. Okay, drop, drop your back. Way backwards. <laughs> right on. This is the 
just have to be a little brave to take that. <coughs> take the plunge. First step. Okay. And now it's a slide. Think of your feet. <coughs> Both feet. Yeah. All right. Give me your foot, your foot straight down. Okay. okay. Check out this room. They get slippery right there. That's on mud. That drop right where your feet are, that's the one part that is kind of hard. Oh, just come out a little bit. <laughs> Thank you, I didn't see that. I was like, why is my feet not holding? Yeah. Okay. That's super slick. <laughs> I can take a hand if you want. <laughs> Naively think we're the worst of the twigs, but it looks like we have some more. Lab ascent, moderate angle, good traction. Looks like that's the rest of it. So we're on a hike out now. And that by accident. And now we have to go down and go up this canyon here to get out. We're doing a little bit of orienteering. We're taking the fun way. Oh yes. The hike out wasn't quite as dicey as we thought it would be. Very pretty, in fact. Cool layers lay down for the eons. They say 200 million years ago. As you can see, the walkout is very lush and incredibly technical. They say the hike out is arduous. It's definitely not that bad. The car is a little pixel over there. But the worst thing was oh, the river bottoms. All the sticks. That was abusive.